What we've been doing to the planet is unsustainable. Many people suffer from the way the economy is structured. We're designed to be peaceful and joyful and playful. Somehow we've persuaded ourselves that we're supposed to suffer and be in pain and fight and win a game we made up. And the whole thing is hilarious and, and tragic. We're going to have to move away from our corporate structures, all of the different aspects of society that separate us. I wouldn't predict, but I would bet that if we make this transformation the way I hope we do, the institutions won't look anything like they do today. It's a fine line of taking too much and not taking enough. My people are a proud people, and my people have been here, we believe, since the beginning of time. We rely on the 13 moons. They tell us what to do. White Western linear thinkers are always trying to fix, always trying to grab for better or different, even regeneration. Most of us have been so conditioned to behave like machines that we've lost the opportunity to be rooted in what is alive and what is full of energy. Empathy, compassion, and courage are perhaps central to where we need to go. And they're also integral to who we are as humans. I spend so much of my life trying to be something. And it just strikes me as hilarious because I, I just made myself up. I feel very sad for people of wealth and intelligence who just keep doing the same old thing. And all they want to do is make more money. They play golf, they go fishing, they go on vacation. That's all they do. And I think there's a way to give them a purpose that's really meaningful and fulfilling and maybe not so unfamiliar because we're wrapping business around that. They've got on the one hand this short-term pressure for quarterly earnings and beating expectations. On the other hand, they've got to rework their entire business models. Uh, without the capital that supports that transformation, working in relationship with these enterprises, it may not be possible. That doesn't mean humanity will fail. That means these institutions will either need to collapse or be fundamentally reimagined. In rhythm with all the principles of a living system, regeneration arises. Syntropy gives entropy the permission to regenerate. And I think the thing that makes our tears come or makes our heart break is different, and that's good. We all need to be operating in different places. <laughs>